Hello, everyone, and welcome to Trailer Sodes, episode 70. I'm Kelvin. And I'm Robert. Uh, so today we're doing the trailer for Force of Nature, starring Old Mel Gibson and Emil, uh, I can't think of his last name, from Freaks. Um, I gotta say, this one, this one confused me a bit. So it started off looking like a big budget action movie. Um, but then as the more you watch it, it starts to fade into what looks like a uh, sci-fi network movie. No offense to those guys. Uh, sci-fi network movie. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what do you think of this one, right? I think a lot of it had to do then, surprisingly, with Mel Gibson. I don't know. Part of it was his voice that he uses. Is it some kind of Italian accent? It's it's a weird, it's like, it sounds like crazy person voice, you know what I mean? Like if he was to play a crazy person. <laughs> Hello, sugar tits. Yeah, like that. <laughs> <laughs> like that's kind of what it sounds like. It's like he's trying to be gruffer. Maybe he's, maybe that's what he really sounds like now. I don't know. But he just sounds like he's being gruffy and, and it's, it's just a weird accent and it throws me a little bit. And then just his acting threw me a little bit too. Like everybody else seems like they're doing a decent job, but then he kind of, for some odd reason, I don't know what it is. He stands out in a bad way for me in this trailer and then there's it feels a little bit recycled mm. like they're like they're doing the whole thing and like it's something happening during a storm we just Money had uh, yeah we just had crawl and yeah. there's you know with there's a movie with us uh, coming yeah you just what you just mentioned and then there's like i don't know it just seemed like recycled material and then they're just splicing together with a couple you know decent actors and then there's male and then it just didn't it didn't feel right why is that why, he's back we, last last episode we talked about uh the cop from dexter and mm-hmm. he's either a cop or a crooked cop or, or a bad crook. guy yeah, yeah. That's, that's how i kind of see him too so he's stuck <laughs> that way um why is there 55 million dollars in the basement of this makes, makes makes no sense like yeah the whole it just doesn't. It doesn't it's work. A, it's an apartment complex, but there's mm. for some odd reason fifty five million dollars sitting down there. Um Yeah. That's weird. Uh he yeah, I don't I don't know what Mel is doing these days. Um He's doing this. This is what he's doing. Did, did, did some of the storm animations start to fall apart for you? As well. I, I didn't really notice it because I was like trying to focus in on what was going on and then Mel yeah. kept popping up with his funny <laughs> voice and it just ruined it for me. Remember, shoot the kill. <laughs> yeah, and then it's like the little one-liners. I don't even get it. Like, they didn't even work. They put them in the, in the trailer like it was really going to be something that you were going to like. You know, a little, little catch line at the end. But it wasn't. For me, it was something I disliked. So it made you think me he not. still thinks it's the 80s? Because that, that was the age of one-liners. And he mm-hmm. was- <laughs> it's possible. I, yeah, uh, yeah. I don't know. There, I mean, there was something a little bit off about this one. Uh, I mean, the plot, like like I said, though, doesn't. This is my biggest thing. It doesn't really. Five, like I don't normally want more in trailers, but this one, I was just a hint of why there's fifty five million. There should have been. There should have been less in this trailer. This trailer was too long, and it gave too much. It was pretty long. I think if it was uh if they had shortened it and not concentrated on some things more so than others, then it would have been a better. It made it would have made me want to watch the movie more. This doesn't. This trailer does not make me want to watch the movie. No, yeah, me either. This is one I would miss. And he just have like a, you, you know what I started to think because of all those floors, even though the action uh, and this is no way compared only because of the the setup, uh, like a raid vibe. Ah, I knew you were gonna say that. I even bring that up. That's nothing like this. this is- but I, I don't think they're yeah they they're gonna yeah they, there's no way they can do that with with what we just saw. But I got a feeling that they're gonna try and. Uh, <laughs> It just feels like a whole bunch of other movies. Like there's just little pieces here and there, and where you're gonna take all these other ideas. Like I watched all this stuff, and I'm just gonna play, you know, do a little collage of all the other movies I watched, and call it Force of Nature. Boom! Yeah. <laughs> That's his trailer. Yep. <laughs> Not for but, me. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't pass on this one. But uh, yeah, that's Trailer Shows this week. Robert, <laughs> <laughs> go watch some other trailer, people. <laughs>